My name is Dr. Darren Udine. I'm the CEO of Frugal Disruptive, and I'm going to spend a few minutes talking you through our flagship product, Tribal Browser. We have a problem with the way the internet works. When I search for something like art, using a popular search engine, no names mentioned, I get over one billion hits. Now I can spend eternity trawling through the links, but what I want is a ten or so links that I'd like. The top links are either paid for or play the system, so their sites get into the top ten. So, how do we know what sort of sites we'd like? Well, it's very simple, and the process has worked throughout history. The web pages we'd probably want to see are the ones that are recommended by our friends, or people of a like-minded mindset. Even the links the bloke in the pub recommends to you will probably be a better bet than the ones that the global ad companies promote. It essentially boils down to this. Humans are tribal. They like to group together with like-minded people who share ideas and socialize. No one wants to be sitting at the dinner party as the odd one out. You want to be with people you like. If you want to search for something like art, for example, wouldn't it be better if you only got the sites that your friends and the people you respect recommend? You don't really want to see sites that companies with lots of money promote. In fact, this leads neatly onto another major problem. Why do you have to type this longurl.com to get to a site? And who decides which addresses map onto which sites anyway? Some nameless, unelected body that decides who owns what site and asks for cash up front? Why can't we the people decide which sites map onto which IP addresses or URLs? Why can't I decide what IP address points to art and share it with my tribe? If you're of a religious persuasion, you probably want to see sites and links that reflect your beliefs. Not a lot of extraneous stuff that you don't care about, or worse still, find offensive. If you're a parent, you probably want to have an internet that caters for parents and children, without having to complain to the internet giants to police the web on your behalf. So the answer to these problems is Tribal Browser. Tribal Browser is a new system to free the internet for you, the user. The concept is simple. We have created a browser that bypasses ICANN and does the mapping of sites to URLs for you, using the ones you choose. Yes, you! For example, you can map this site, uiron.com, to art, and when you use the browser, you just enter the URL, i.e. just enter the word art, and it goes directly to the site. Tribal Browser presents a new internet ecosystem that works like this. First, you create your own tribe. Call it anything you want. Once you do that, you can start adding your own IP and URL mappings. For example, art equals yudine.com, good art equals stackism.com. Once this is done, all your friends or anyone that shares the same ideas as you can join your tribe and create their own mappings to add to your tribal web. And guess what? Unlike already existing restrictive systems, I can, I can't, you can have any mappings in any language and in any script. Why should internet sites be in English or the Latin script? Why do you need to pay the salaries of nameless bureaucrats for the privilege of mapping your IP address to a Latin-based site name? Well, now you don't. You could have your maps in Hebrew, Sanskrit, Arabic. In fact, any Unicode font you want, and more are popping up all the time as we speak. Anyway, back to the system. Once you map a site, it's available to all your tribe members, and all your tribe members can add their own unique sites so eventually, what will emerge will be a living, dynamic, tribal ecosystem. A matrix of sites and people who all share the same ideas, and dare I say, dreams. This forest of ideas will propagate tribal information for the benefit of the tribe, without the fear of seeing sites that have been paid for by sponsors, given precedence by corporate friends. You only see the internet through the eyes of the tribe, without the clutter, the adverts, the spam sites, and the irrelevant. We're returning the internet back to an age when we had real freedom. Now the icing on the cake is this. This technology is entirely open source, which means that anyone can set up their own tribal browser system on any machine and start hosting their own tribes and sites. Create your own private networks or public spaces. It's your choice. The code is available on GitHub for you to play with right now. Secondly, the URL or mapping system uses a cloud-based database backend, so it's totally scalable. You can have a hundred sites or a million. The power of cloud computing is here to stay and basically means that we, as Frugal Disruptive, can totally disrupt the internet. 
features of Tribal Browser. Tribal Browser is an internet browser, but it only browses to the sites or mappings that your tribe chooses. So instead of billions of sites, you have a well thought out selection of links that you are guaranteed to like. You don't even have to map sites in English or the Latin script. You can map it in any language or script you want. Plus, you don't have to pay someone the privilege of doing it. It's free. The browser wrapper is open source. You can take the code, hack it up, and deploy your own tribal browsers. Play with the source. Go on. You know you want to. We use cloud technology, so it's fully scalable for a frugally cheap price. You can create your own networks or tribes and bypass the big boys. So why Kickstarter? We basically need funds to make this a reality and also to spread the word. There are a few reasons why we need the cash. Firstly, we need the cloud host for our scalable database and we need funds for that for at least a year to get things going. Secondly, the software is currently in its alpha release stage and we need someone full time to manage the code base and fix stuff. We're also in the process of doing an Android port, so funds will greatly help us source the time for the development on that. Thirdly, we need to know if people will actually use it, what community interest we can garner and how to spread the word. And Kickstarter is a great platform for that. So what's in it for you and why should you fund us? Firstly, you'll be freeing the internet from the big corporations. In fact, even better than that, you'll be creating your own internet in whatever language you desire. Once you create your own web, you can be in charge of it and don't have to be worried about writing to the government to police it. You, the people, can be in control. You can set up your cloud map on any secure server and free yourself and your tribe. So apart from freeing your mind, here's a breakdown of the rewards. One pound, a big thank you, and also our latest Android app, worth two pounds 99. And you'll also be listed as a supporter. 15 pounds, all of the above. Plus, get regular updates on Tribal Browser. You'll get an official release once that is completed too. £25, all of the above, plus get beta releases of Tribal Browser. You'll also get access to our online developer forum, where you can influence the future of Tribal Browser. £35, all of the above, plus you'll get general documentation on how the code works, and general coding tips by the maestros at Frugal Disruptive. £50, all of the above, plus we'll give you in-depth documentation on Tribal Browser and 50% discounts on the next three Frugal Disruptive apps. £100, all of the above, plus become a tribal elder. We'll give you exclusive rights to administrate the tribal system with the ability to edit tribes and sites at will. £200, all of the above, plus you'll get access to future cutting-edge development work by Frugal Disruptive. £500, all of the above, plus You'll become a release sponsor and we'll name you on our websites, forums and in the tool. £1,000 or more, you'll get all of the above. Plus, you'll get an official hand embellished painting from international stuckist artist Dr. Down Your Dial, CEO of Frugal Disruptive. That's me, of course. £5,000 or more, become a tribal founder. Your logo and information will be shown prominently on the default tribal browser homepage, as you will have helped make this dream become a reality. Thank you for listening. Even if you don't support us in our campaign, I hope that you find your freedom wherever you are.